These are the Bose AR frames, the first AR glasses from Bose. And I'm extremely excited about them because, well, these are the first AR glasses that I'm actually going to wear outside. They are $199. And what you get for $199, how they look and what they can do, I'm going to show you in this video coming up. Hi and welcome to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang and this is your first time here. If you're just as excited about VR and AR as me, then subscribe now and click on the bell button so don't miss anything. Yeah, so these are the Bose AR frames and let me tell you why I'm excited about these AR glasses from Bose. First of all, these are the first AR glasses that Bose has ever done. And the special thing about them, well, they are not so expensive. They cost $199. And what else is special? Well, the AR part, the augmented reality part, is not done via a video signal that you would see. So you don't see any kind of video that is superimposed over the reality. No, actually, all the augmentation comes via audio. So there are some special programs that Bose is building or actually some kind of ecosystem that Bose wants to establish and everything works via audio augmentation. So for example, if you're using like Google Maps, for example, you will hear where you have to go, like, uh, yeah, turn left or turn right. And everything simply works via audio. And I think that is a really cool method of doing it. And I can't wait to actually try them out. So these cost $199. They are available now in the United States. If you are not in the United States, you can buy them through a service like Big Apple Buddy. How to do that, you can see in the description below. I had sent them over to, to Germany via Big Apple Buddy. In this first video about the Bose AR glasses, I'm simply going to find out what's in the box and I'm going to put them on for the very first time. For the full review, it's going to take a while because I simply have to use them. And I will do so since I'm going to go on a little vacation to Taiwan tomorrow and I'm going to use them all the way and then afterwards, I'm going to give you my full review. But now, let's check out what's in the box. And here's the moment of truth. Let's open this. And the first thing that we see is a very nice black stylish Bose carrying case. And this is what holds the Bose AR glasses. Here is some more documentation. We're going to have a look at that later. But now let's open this carrying case. Looks very stylish indeed. So let's open this and here we're going to have a glimpse at the Bose AR glasses. These are the Bose frames. This is the first look at the glasses. This is being held together by some kind of magnet. So this is well done. Let's get them out for the first time now. And the very first feeling that I have here is, wow, they are truly lightweight. Bose says they are 45 grams and yeah, that kind of fits the bill. It's really, really light. I just came back from CES where I checked the Enri glasses and they were like 80 grams, but these are even lighter. So here on the right, as you can tell, once it's sharp now, this is the port. So this is how you connect the glasses to electricity via USB cable. And this is how you charge them. Then let's have a look at the other side. So here only the, the speaker part here that transfers the audio to your ear. And let's have a look at, at the little button. Now the little button is here on the right of the device. Check it out. It's a small golden colored button. And with this button, you're going to turn on the device and actually use it. Let's check out what else is here in the box. So in this little pouch, we will find the, the charging cable. Let's have a look at the charging cable together. And this connects also via magnetic connection to the port that I've just shown you. So here, this fits exactly to the port. And this is 
how you would charge the device. All right, let's have a look at the documentation. Actually, it's very straightforward. It's only like two pages and they show you that you should download the Bose Connect app and that you should click on the button to connect. And you know what? I'm going to show you how easy it is. So once you have downloaded the app, you open it and you click on the button. I've done it already. And now what happens? Boom. You only have to swipe up now or down actually and then the device is going to connect to your smartphone. It's really that simple. Ready to connect. To start All right, so I've unboxed the Bose AR frames and I think they do look pretty cool and I'm looking forward to try them out on myself. I've paired them to my Pixel 2 XL and well now I'm going to wear them for the very first time and well you can watch this so here we go these are the bose ar frames and how does it look <laughs> i think it does look quite normal just like quite normal sunglasses and well they are paired now to my pixel and i'm going to try now to play some uh Oh, let me let me turn them on again because they got disconnected and now they are connected again and I could hear something Wow very cool actually what just happened uh, I was clicking the button here and automatically my 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 Google assistant started and I could hear the Google assistant answer and it, it just sounded really Perfect. Oh, wow. Cool. Let me try that again. Um, or let me try it here. What's the time in San Francisco? Wow. I'm not sure if you heard that over the over the speaker. I heard it very, very clear here on these on these frames. And it just felt as if I had something in my ear, as if I had some earphones in my ear. So this is truly cool. <laughs> what you're seeing here is the very, very first ears on to this device. And the nice thing is I can also take calls now with, 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 these, uh, with these Alto um, sunglasses or AR glasses and definitely all of these things I'm going to try out now when I bring these to my uh, to my vacation when I go to Taiwan tomorrow and also from my vacation I will definitely keep you updated about all the things that are happening but now you know what I'm going to play some music now let me simply um, start the start some music app like yeah Amazon music on my phone and I'm going to play some music now. Let's let's play some music. Oh, my music. Let's play this here, this song. Oh yeah. So I'm playing now Levels from Avicii <clears throat> and oh, the sound, it sounds really good. Let me let me turn it up. Let me turn up the the volume like really loud now. <clears throat> okay. So the interesting part is I can still hear, yeah, my my voice obviously. Like, oh, <laughs> wow, this is good. So I I hear the music really loud and very very purely and clear. The sound quality is great. But it does not like um, stop me from hearing other things, right? Wow. Wow. Oh my goodness. And wow, cool. So I'm not, I have no idea how much you hear from me now, from this, from this sound now. Like the microphone is very close to me. So probably you should hear it. But well, they say that um, yeah, your surrounding will actually not hear so much. Let me bring that close to you guys. 
Okay, I'm bringing this close now to the microphone, so probably now you can hear something more. It is actually, like the sound is actually really good. Wow. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I'm surprised. I'm really, really surprised right now. <coughs> yeah. And levels from Avicii is getting into full swing now. <coughs> Sorry guys, I caught a little cold. Yeah, okay, let me stop this. It shows now uh, the music that I'm playing, levels, and I can choose, yeah, how, how loud it should be. Let me see what else I can do. It sh also shows me like uh, how much percent it's still loaded, like 10%. So I need to charge it soon. Well, I didn't really charge it in the first place. So yeah. Your product is up to date. So I can, I can also do firmware updates with this. I can do a product tour. Oh, I can turn on voice prompts. So probably yeah, probably there's some voice prompts that I could simply use. So it seems like that at this moment in time, at this very, very early moment in time, let me take this off. It's about listening to your to your music while you're on the go. And yeah, it's about getting your uh, your Google Assistant answers that you would normally get, like like getting all the audio that you get from your phone. You can get them now to your um, sunglasses and you can take your calls. And in the future, there will also be apps, AR apps that will work with, with audio. So everything is augmented um, by audio information and Bose wants to build this ecosystem and this is their vehicle for it. And I must say, I really like them. I think they do look cool. The coolest air glasses as what the looks are concerned and the audio quality is just so surprising. It is simply so surprising to hear that. And well, I can I can just um, show it to you by, by bringing it close to the microphone, what I did before. I can just tell you it sounds it just sounds so surprisingly good. <laughs> Let me bring that again closer to you. It is actually loud and clear. So I'm going to try these out now. I'm going to try these out on my vacation in Taiwan. And uh, well, I will give you the full review after I tried them out really out in the wild. So let me let me stop that now. And let me stop this first impression video and I can just tell you my first impression is I'm amazed by the sound quality. I'm amazed by, by, these, by these sunglasses, my first AR glasses that I'm actually going to wear outside. So these are available right now for $199. These are the Alto version they're also like like round more round glasses you can f find them on the bose website i'm going to link everything down in the description you can buy them for 199 dollars starting from now if you're in the us if you're not in the us you can buy them through big apple buddy and if you use the code mixed reality tv you're going to get 10 dollars off and i'm going to get a 10 dollars kickback to support this channel. So definitely stay tuned to learn more about the, the Bose AR glasses. The full review is coming up. I really hope that you enjoyed this first impression video on the Bose AR glasses. If yes, give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you have not yet sub subscribed to MRTV yet, do so now. I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode.